enjoying the day, Dana? Um. So up bright and early. It's a beautiful day in Arizona. It's cloudy. So we're going to go check out the uh, Arizona State University Formula SAT, SAE team this morning. Um, they're showing off their car doing some autocross. So we're going to go uh, check it out and see what it's all about. We've been one of their sponsors for seven years now, and uh, they've made a lot of progress this year. So it's important to see where they're going with it. Of course, we'll never turn down a chance to take the NSX out for a spin. When we arrived at the parking lot, the SAE team had already pulled the vehicles out of the trailer, and unfortunately, they were already working on them. What do you guys think of what's going on? Oh, it's, uh, it sounds like it's down a cylinder on crank. And oh, yeah? It's also misfired and revving. So. Actually, I'm pulling the spark plug. Okay. Yes, let's think positive. Spark plug, yeah, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I'm assuming your board is scoping down there to see if you see something in the pistons. Look in the, I'm going to look at the valves, but it's kind of rough to get the scope. Maybe there. burned a valve or something? Yeah. So what happened was last night, it let out a pop, according to our driver, it let out a pop, and he shut it off and restarted, and then he's doing this now. The engine show out, I think, after it popped. But wait a second, what is Formula SAE? Formula SAE is an undergraduate program available at most colleges where they're challenged to build a complete formula-style car from scratch. Competition is an engineering competition. It still does require functionality of the entire car. So once completed, all cars are judged not only statically, but is also dynamically in settings such as autocross, brake tests, etc. While the club can only field one car in competition, the old car is always used as a learning tool for new members. In this case, it's also not cooperating. So the team is trying to address it in the field as well. So tell me what the heck's going on in the back of this car. Uh, right now, we're, we're trying to solve some of the issues with the differential. When we were first running this car for our shakedown, the problem we had is that the chain was too loose and it was rubbing on the edge of the chassis. So right now, what we're trying to do is tighten the chain, but it's turned out to be a, a bigger problem than we anticipated. Okay. Race cars, right? Yeah. yeah. Be a race car speed, race car problems. Right. Yeah. While the engineers are working on the vehicle, the business team is hard at work trying to entertain the folks who came out to support them via doing ride-alongs with the NASCAR team as well as selling shirts. We ran into some interesting folks ourselves. All right, so we found someone from, from Singapore who also lived where I live and likes cars too. I don't know about this shirt though. This shirt's kind of, no, no, it's, it's kind of, a, it's a Debbie That's Downer. His. <laughs> it's his. It, it doesn't say Red Bull like it should. <laughs> hey, Red Bull fan, let's go. Cool. It's right, it's right. Cause you know, we like our cars to make it to the actual end of the race. <laughs> Preferably in front of everyone else instead of in the back or, you know. So it's just kidding, Ferrari, we love you, but not really. <laughs> After quite a bit of work, the guys were able to finally put the car back together and give everyone some test runs. After all, that's why we all came, to see how this vehicle is progressing over last year's model. The team takes safety very seriously, and all the drivers are required to wear full fire gear, just in case. Ooh, <laughs> Look at you, look at you. That's what you keep saying, buddy, but I, I wonder. What was that pep talk there, Mason? <laughs> if it's gonna go wrong, it's gonna happen early, or it'll happen. It's either now or in about 20 minutes. I don't know which one. <laughs> death. All I pray is that my death is glorious. A glorious fireball. <laughs> It wasn't the glory run we were hoping for, but 
it just shows that they don't ever give up. So if you are at a college and are interested in race cars, engineering, any of that kind of stuff, check out your local FSAE team. If you're local to Arizona, make sure to check these guys out. I'll put the link in the video. And thanks for watching.